it's actually very interesting because I'm not used to this perspective. Hey everyone, James with Inspiration here, your source for family-friendly photography education. Today I'm at my grandpa's house, and I'm going to go on around taking pictures for the latest shoot to serve photo assignment, looking up. There are several challenges when it comes to um, shooting this assignment today. It is in the middle of the day, and we have some very harsh sunlight, and I'm kind of in a neighborhood, so uh, it's going to be a little bit challenging. Thankfully though, we've got blue sky up there, and a sun that's shining brightly, so hopefully we can incorporate that with some shots. It's a good exercise, I think, for photographers to look around their surroundings in a different way, differently than they normally would. And so just to walk around and think, well, what is above me right now? Like, I'm walking beside a building and I look up, you know, like what's there? Uh, walking by a tree, what's there? And we've got a creek right down here. If I were to get down in the creek, what does that look like? No, this location didn't really work too swell. I was hoping I could get low enough that you could kind of see some of the bank coming up on either side but it's not a deep enough ditch. There sure are a lot of power lines up there. You know, it doesn't seem like there's very much on this trail pretty open. So I think I'm going to grab the bike, Grandpa's bicycle, and see if I can't get someplace where there might be more trees along the trail. Is his bike in there? Oh, I don't know. Ah, oh, look at that. There's a bike. <gasps> okay, let me see if I can get the key. Let's see. Here it is. I wonder if there's any air in the tires doesn't look like it. No, no air in the tires. Um, maybe there is a pump? I haven't gone biking on around here for ages. So it doesn't look like he has an air pump to be able to uh, get the bike working. So I guess what I'll do is, I just have a little bit of time left. Um, I think there's a road that goes up behind his house over here. I don't know how well you can see back up in there. On that road is where there'll be more trees along the side of the road. And so hopefully I'll be able to get, you know, more perspective, you know, more interesting things looking up than kind of the blank blue sky that I was seeing on the trail. <laughs> So it's been kind of a fun little assignment, looking up, finding perspectives and angles outside of what we would normally shoot. Today, I walked on the trail, and there wasn't much to take pictures of because there weren't very many elements along the side of the trail. And because this assignment is for, um, to backdrop the hymn more like the master, I wanted something more natural in appearance, not like buildings or telephone poles and stuff like that. So, I didn't like the trail, I came back to Grandpa's, tried to, tried to get his bike, turns out that didn't work out, and um, walked up behind his house just a little bit to see if there, there was some other angles and different trees and stuff, but it turns out that this little tree right here in Grandpa's backyard was actually the most beautiful, the most interesting. There's more beauty up there than I realized, than, than I thought. And I felt like I could capture some angles and perspectives because it's such a, such a, interesting tree with all the gnarled branches and stuff. So it's kind of a fun little tree to play around with. 
and I never thought to take pictures, you know, from, from this perspective. So now it's your turn to shoot this assignment. Details are in the description below. If you have any questions along the way, feel free to ask in the comments below. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like this video, give me a thumbs down. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, feel free to subscribe by clicking on my face. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you learned a lot. Keep learning with Linspiration, and we'll see you next time.